beginning with warrior two. Start in a wide stance, opening up through the hips. Your front foot is facing forward, toes pointed directly at the front of your mat. Bend deeply into the front knee, bringing your front thigh to a 90 degree angle with your knee directly above your ankle. Extend your arms out perpendicular to the mat, engaging all of your arm muscles. Be mindful not to tense your shoulders. Keep your shoulder blades back and down. Neck and spine is long. Engage your abdominal muscles to support your lower back. Relax the muscles of the face, the jaw, the brows, and keep a soft gaze focusing directly above your outstretched fingers. Breathe deeply as you sustain the posture. Hold and strengthen. Keep firmly rooted through the feet, engaging all of your muscles as you open up through the hips and chest. Continue breathing. Switching sides, you're going to repeat the steps you did on the opposite leg now. Keep a long spine, bend deeply into the front knee, extend your arms out perpendicular to the mat. Remember to keep your arm muscles engaged, especially the triceps. Being mindful not to tense your shoulders. Gaze softly in front of you. Keep the facial muscles relaxed. Remember to breathe in through the nose, out through the nose, keeping firmly rooted through the feet. Continue breathing. To come into triangle pose, stand with your feet about a leg distance apart. Turn one foot out so your toes are pointing to the short edge of your mat. Inhale as you reach up and out, extending your upper body over the leg as you shift your hips towards the back of the mat. Exhale as you bring your arm down, placing your hand on your shin, your ankle, the mat, or a block. Rotate your ribs towards the ceiling and breathe. Point the other arm straight up to the ceiling, hand in line with your shoulder, palm facing forwards. Option here to stretch the arm over your head to get a deeper stretch. Keep breathing. You may also try a bind by dropping the arm behind you and reaching to grab the inner thigh of your opposite leg. Lengthening through the sides of the neck keeping the neck long. Preparing now to do the other side. We're going to come out of this pose and switch sides. Option here to modify using a block. Repeat the steps now on the opposite side, raising the arms up as you inhale. Exhale out and down supporting yourself with the block. You may wish to look up at the ceiling with the neck long. Experiment with each pose and find the position that you can practice with enough challenge while still remaining supportive. Never force your body. If it's more comfortable to look down, then look down instead. Remember to keep breathing. Coming into crescent pose, take a long lunge back, bending your front knee to 90 degrees, aligning your knee directly over the heel of your front foot, both feet facing forward. Arms remain straight as you reach up, extending out through the fingertips. Both feet should be facing forward. Your front shin should be perpendicular to the floor. Lift your back leg strongly, 
drawing your knee and quadriceps up toward the ceiling. Straighten your back leg, but be mindful not to lock your knee. Reminder to keep breathing here. You can extend your arms back, chest out, as you look up to the ceiling. Inhale as you engage the muscles of your core to maintain the upright position. Arms overhead reaching toward the ceiling. Tuck your pelvis gently and draw your tailbone in toward the floor. Option to practice strength here by leaning your upper body out and over the bent leg. Spine straight. Hold for three long breaths. Keep both feet firmly on the mat. You can also practice your balance by coming up on the standing leg into airplane pose. Here you can experiment with your hands and find a stable balance. Explore and have fun. Keep breathing in through the nose and out through the nose. Option to come into a standing split here. Practice and do what you can. Never force the body. Keep breathing. Slowly come out of the pose. We're going to do the other side now. Lunging back as we did with the other side. Inhale as you lift the arms up. Make sure your front shin stays vertical. Widen or adjust your stance as needed. Keep the neck and spine long. Keep the facial muscles relaxed, jaw relaxed, eyebrows relaxed, breathing. We're going to lean out the upper body over the bent front leg and build strength here as you keep breathing, keeping the body long and strong. Option to come out into a balance. If you lose your balance, don't worry, that's fine. That's why we practice. It's all part of the practice. Just find your stance again, stabilize and balance. Experiment with the hand posture to find stability. Keep breathing. Keep your core engaged. Breathing in through the nose and out through the nose. Coming back to standing now. Now come into mountain pose. Standing upright with your feet facing forward, parallel to each other. Your arms come down to your sides, palms facing forward. Find alignment and strength through your entire body here, stacking your shoulders, hips, knees, and ankles as you gaze forward softly. Keep the jaw and facial muscles relaxed. Maintain gentle deep breaths in and out through the nose. Keep breathing. Bring your palms together and we say namaste.